Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel Web Tutorial Guru. In this video, you will learn how to create website using HTML and CSS. So for this video, I have already prepared a PhD for this tutorial video. In this PhD, on top there is a header which is going to be fixed throughout this website. Below this navigation bar, there is a banner section where I will use an image, my name and some social icons and there will be an animated mouse icon. Next we have a about me section. In every section we will have a title of that section. In about me section we will have two sides. Left side will contain an image and on the right side we will have some text and some personal information. Next we will have skills section. We will have six blocks of different types of skills. After this we will have a services section where we have six blocks of different services available. Next we will have a portfolio section where we will have a list of all projects in grid form. After this we have a contact section where on the top of this section we have four blocks of various information and below these boxes we will have a google map and on the top of this google map on the right side we will have a contact us form. At the bottom of this website we will have a strip for the trademark section or you can say copyright section. But you can also use this template for your personal portfolio website. Apart from the PSD, let me show you the directory which we will gonna use in this tutorial. In this directory, we will have 4 folders and some files in them. In CSS folder, there is a style.css file which is blank right now. In img folder, there are some images and a folder named portfolio which contains the images of portfolio section. In js folder, there are 2 files. One is jQuery.min.js which is jQuery library and another one is script.js which is also a blank JS file. In particle JS folder we have two files one is particle.js and another one is configuration file for particle.js library. Apart from these files and folder there are two more files. First one is PhD file which I have already explained to you in the beginning of this video and second file is index.html which is not blank. Let me show you the content of index.html file. So here it is. It contains only some basic html tags and some links of our directory files and one external file which is font awesome library. But don't worry I will give you the download link of this directory in the description below so just check the link below. One more thing I wanna tell you that this complete tutorial will be available in some parts. So if you are new to our YouTube channel then subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you will never miss any update from our side. Also please don't forget to leave your valuable suggestion and feedback. Best of luck from my side, Web Tutorial Group.